Joker, as I expected, you appear to be safe. However, where exactly are we? Velvet room? I'm not sure I understand. At first, I was surprised to see the masses chained in a prison. Yet, here I am as well. Considering the state of the real world, it is hard to say that we were even remotely helpful. This situation... Can we truly handle such horrid circumstances? All the Phantom Thieves can do is change the hearts of others. However, the world outside has become a veritable hell. Nothing within our power can fix that. I'm merely acknowledging how powerless I am. The people of this world desired their enslavement. And that isn't all. They screamed at us for attacking the Holy Grail. Defended it. Even the criminals whose hearts we changed became meek followers of the Holy Grail because of us. Were we truly that foolish? Risking our lives for a result nobody desired. I... That's right. It wasn't just for recognition from those we were helping. My purpose lies elsewhere. When we first met, you continued to impose yourselves on me, no matter how much I pushed you away. I will forever treasure what you did for me. Very well. Just as art is meant to break boundaries, people should be saved even if they frown upon it. I won't allow the justice I believe in to be shaken any further. Allow me to thank you, Joker. Being by your side truly gives rise to the greatest ideas. Ah, yes. We cannot afford to leave reality in the hellish state it's currently in. I will make use of my role as an artist, and paint over the distortions of society. Well then, time to go and see this through. I'll witness with my own two eyes that this world isn't bound by some holy grail. Well then. We will be counting on you. Yo. Looks like we're both somehow still alive and kicking. But where at? Huh? Velvet? Man, this prison cell kind of makes me think of when we first met. I remember how Shibuya was all effed up just now, but like, nobody was seeing any of it. No, it was more like they didn't want to see any of it. What the hell? So, even all them people who are suffering and cheering for us to come and help them, in reality, they would have rather just had everything stay how it was? Did what we were doing have any meaning at all? <laughs> You're so freaking tough. You know, Back when I thought we were gonna die, without learning the truth about all this, I kind of felt for the first time that maybe we hadn't been doing the right thing. That maybe we deserved to lose. You get me? Now that I'm thinking about it, I, I started all this because of how pissed off I was. Maybe it's never been about winning or anything like that. Maybe all I was doing was just continuing my own defiance. 
it's fine? <laughs> You're right. I get it now. We're doing this to make sure people don't gotta go through the same crap we did. It doesn't matter if they think we're just or not. We gotta do what we believe in. <laughs> it's not like people think much of me anyways. I'm gonna dash through this the only way I know how. You got me out of prison, just like before. Thanks. You know, it's kind of embarrassing to say this, but uh, I'm really glad I met you. All right, I'm done getting my ass kicked. That shiny bastard acts like it's some kind of god. I ain't gonna feel good till we deal with it. Let's head out. We're gonna take down that asshole, yeah? Hey. We'll be counting on you. Joker. I'm relieved. Looks like we're both still alive. And you even managed to get out of your cell by yourself. Impressive, as always. Shibuya. What happened? And where are we? Velvet Room? That name sounds pretty kick-ass. <sighs> I guess my fears turned out to be true. The real world is a scary place. Pain like this can never reach you if you keep yourself cooped up indoors. Who am I to think I can tell the people what to do? I mean, I used to be a shut-in myself. Damn it. I just want to go home. But even that would be tough now. Giving up would be too painful. You know, I think I've changed. I don't know when it happened, but I can't... I can't let people suffer like this, even if I don't know them personally. Grown? Honestly, this all seems like a bit too much. But... but... I... You're right. My heart has been set from the start. I don't want to run away from this. I ran from my mom's death for so long. I misunderstood it. Everything was just too painful for me to handle. But I never want to be left in the dark again. That's probably why my persona is a little bit special. Because I want to learn the truth. That's how I really feel. Well, I've come this far. I'll follow you wherever you go, on my own two feet. You have such a strong heart, Joker. You saved me yet again. Thanks. I'm so happy. Like, so much that I can't even express it in my normal words. Anyway, we're going up against a god. I couldn't even leave my own room before, but now we're gonna beat a god! I'm so pumped! And wait a sec. I just noticed I got out of here on my own. Ta-da! A real jailbreak! Whoa! 
Oh, you're quick to act. That's what makes you dependable. All right, time to get back at it. Huh? What? What is this place? Who are they? My name is Igor. I am the master of the Velvet Room. I am Lavenza, a resident of this place as well. We have been waiting for all of you. Velvet Room? My master has just been released from a long period of imprisonment. His powers have not fully returned. Though it may be presumptuous of me, I will speak on his... Hey, where's Morgana? Would you like to see him? He's right over there. That's where you were hiding? I... was born here. It was to dispel an evil being from man's spiritual world. Mona? My role was to find the trickster and help him defeat it. That's why I was created here by my master. Indeed. I really remember everything. When this place was about to be taken over, my master gathered the last traces of mankind's hope. He mustered up his remaining strength to make me. The entity that calls itself a god is a malevolent will that forces man into everlasting servitude. It hopes to attain eternal peace by filling reality with those who have stopped thinking for themselves. That is the ruin of man that this evil god envisions. I... um... don't get what you're saying at all. Oh, be quiet and listen! We don't have much time left! W wait a moment. The Holy Grail is a, a god? I was wondering why it had a will of its own, but... Are you implying that it isn't a treasure? No. As the distorted desires of the masses, it is most certainly the core of Mementos itself. Then, did the treasure become a god because people wish to be ruled over? That is correct. To decide the fate of the world, it chose two people with potential and pitted them against each other. One, Goro Akechi, incited the masses' distortion. Had he won, the world would have been destroyed and remade. The other was a trickster who would stand up against this. That was him. If he won, the human world would be left as is. Those were the conditions of the game. At least, that's what should have happened. That malevolent being knew that a revolution would not occur within indolent humans. After all, it is the masses' distorted desires incarnate. However, my true master believed in humanity. He believed that a trickster would rise among the people and accomplish this change. But that evil entity laughed at the prospect and sought to prove the powerlessness of man with the game. And he had great potential, which is why it approached him. It helped train the trickster only to cast him into despair, using the masses who rejected their savior. This was likely its means to nip in the bud anything that would pose a threat. Now that I think back to when I was separated, I felt a disagreement to the word rehabilitation. Of course I did. It was just a means for the fake to keep you under surveillance. Basically, this guy was dragged into a game where the evil god rigged the outcome. Damn it! What the hell? Your real world has already been fused with mementos. You do not exist because reality is replete with the cognition of those who deny the Phantom Thieves. It can be said that the world is one step away from the evil god's machinations. However, there is still hope. 
Now that the evil god's identity has been exposed, you can see your rehabilitation to its completion. Only you can leave this prison and save this distorted world and its captive people. Young man, guided by Morgana and worthy of the trickster name, you must challenge the evil god and reclaim your existence in reality. Are you up to the task? Let's destroy that annoying shiny treasure jerk for sure this time! <laughs> Excellent. There is nothing to fear. You already possess the strength to oppose this evil god. <laughs> I am truly looking forward to this. Our mutual friend knows where the exit is. Morgana? Please guide them, and thank you for all that you've done. It's a cruel responsibility that's been cast upon you. I will accept your words of appreciation fully when everything is over. Now follow me! Joker! Shibuya again? Oh, right. This is where we were when our bodies disappeared. Seems like people still haven't realized that this abnormality has taken over the city. Look, the door we just came through. If I remember correctly, this is that quarantine cell. That's right. It was actually the Velvet Room, which had been swallowed by the distortions. You did say you were born in there. It makes so much sense now. Wait. So if we came out of there, does that mean we're the criminals? No, it's more like him, since he was kept in here. Most likely, Joker had been under the malicious guidance of the evil god for quite some time. The Velvet Room originally existed to nurture the human mind. But after it was taken over, it was sealed inside that bastard's nest. Inside Mementos. Uh, Mona? More importantly... You're shining. It's probably because my memories have returned. I know what my duty is now. Uh, <clears throat> whoa. Do you see something? Shining? Wait a sec, what, what's with those weirdly dressed guys? I feel like... I've seen those costumes before. Oh, aren't they? The Phantom Thieves? I kind of remember seeing a silhouette of them on a jumbo screen in the city. The Phantom Thieves? Oh yeah, that's right! I, I completely forgot about them! This is different from how it was before. Do they see us? It doesn't seem to be everyone, though. Only a handful of people in this large crowd. Maybe it's Kazumona's light. Either way, they remember the Phantom Thieves! Oh, the Key of Hope. Mona, guide us. Where must we go? Over there. The bastard from earlier should be in that temple. I'll just add this. Okay. Can you see that further in? That's the temple. Huh. It's nice knowing there aren't gonna be any bullshit traps or nothing this time. All right, let's get moving. Treasure chest? Joker, 
There's a treasure chest. My, this is... Yes. Absconding from your cells is forbidden. Return to your prison post haste. Those who wish to disturb society shall be slain on the very spot they stand. You're the one who's disturbing it! Dissenters must be destroyed. It's useless trying to reason with this guy. Let's beat him and break through here! Seems they finally realize their lives are in danger. Took them long enough. I can't believe they didn't notice until the danger was so close to them. Things are going to get even worse from here on out. The entire city has stopped functioning. At least they can still panic for now. People still don't act for themselves after seeing all this? I'm sorry, but they're hopeless. In any case, let's head to the temple. Focus. Look, over there! It seems guards have appeared. 
The people in the city recognized us, so it's only natural we draw the enemy's attention as well. Well, they can bring it on. I'm starting to get fired up. True form. Is this my 
very well. I am thou. Thou art I. Try this. Sona, go down. Trouble. Let's get him, Fox. On guard. Man, I'm starving. Allow me. Oh Some yeah. Sauce. A touch of red. Bon appetit. Oh man, it's just what I want. <laughs> get out of my face! Can't you want this? <laughs> what the hell? Yeah. Nice. Good work, everyone. That was a difficult opponent.
Halt, rebels! I shall not allow you to continue forth. Come on. Let's beat this one, too. More people should notice the Phantom Thieves if we just make ourselves seen. That's exactly what we want!
person. They just disappeared. They turned into some kind of black fog. children of man. Return from whence you came. Proceeding further shall only serve to shorten your lives. I advise you not as a guardian, but out of the mercy of my heart. Mercy? Don't make me laugh! If you had mercy, you'd never be doing this to the world! Ah, even now thy answer is in weapons drawn. What choice have I in the face of such barbarity? My children's misconduct is mine to absolve, and mine to punish. Let's go! Prepare yourself! Oh, 
Persona! 